Jose Sanchez was born March 28, 1913, into a Catholic Mexican family. Religious freedom wasn't allowed in Mexico at that time because the government thought that religion questioned their authority. Jose Sanchez grew up practicing his faith in private, receiving the sacraments when he could, and praying the rosary daily. At age 13, he asked God to die in defense of the Catholic faith. Not even a year later, he would give up his life for Christ at age 14. Even though Jose Sanchez was so young, he was part of a group called the Cristeros. The Cristeros were a group that fought for religious freedom. In battle, Jose Sanchez saw that one Cristeros leader, Guizar Morfin, was in danger of being captured because his horse had been struck. Jose Sanchez offered Guizar his horse. Guizar had escaped, but Jose Sanchez was captured. The federal troops beat, harassed, and imprisoned Jose Sanchez. While in prison, he wrote a letter to his parents telling them not to mourn, but to take courage and have faith. All Jose Sanchez had to do to be freed was deny his faith, but he could not let himself do that. Jose Sanchez's godfather and sponsor for First Communion, Rafael Sanchez, was actually the one who ordered for him to be assassinated. On February 10, 1928, Jose got to see his family and tell them that he was going to be shot. His aunt was able to bring him Holy Communion. For him, this meant everything. The government troops tortured Jose Sanchez. They cut off the bottom of his feet and forced him to walk on roads through the town to his resting place. While Jose Sanchez was in the midst of the most brutal torture, all he could do was send up prayers to God. A witness said that he hadn't heard any moans from Jose, but rather that he saw the bloody footprinted trail and heard Jose chanting the rosary, praying for his enemies, and saying songs to Our Lady of Guadalupe. He was then forced to dig his own grave. Jose Sanchez was tortured further by being stabbed multiple times. Each time he chanted, Viva Cristo Rey y Santa Maria de Guadalupe, meaning Long Live Christ the King and Our Lady of Guadalupe. A federal leader was then fed up and shot Jose twice in the head, leaving him lifeless in the very grave he dug. Jose Sanchez was canonized October 16, 2016 by Pope Francis. His feast day is February 10th, the day he died. Saint Jose Sanchez de Rio should be an inspiration to all people of the Catholic faith, especially the youth. We should ask for his intercession to live out the saying, Viva Cristo Rey y Santa Maria de Guadalupe.